Dames Judi Dench and Maggie Smith have been called living treasures for their work both on stage and in film. Our entertainment reporter Jill Rappaport got a chance to talk to them about their latest project. Hey, Jill, good morning. Hi, Matt. Well, they're definitely two of the most talented dames from across the pond, and now they are stirring it up in Ladies in Lavender. It's a film which has two women our age, and that is rare. He's so young, isn't he? Yes, he is. It's just so much of a fairy story. Yeah. It's a fairy tale. In Ladies in Lavender, Dames Judi Dench and Maggie Smith star as elderly sisters, who, after a violent storm, take in a handsome young man who has washed ashore. He's alive. We don't know where he's come from. And then he's, because he stays with us and we look after him, it alters he, us all, doesn't it? Yes, it does. It alters the whole, our relationship. What now? Yes. He might be asleep. Well, if he is, I won't. What's the matter with you? In the beginning, it's very maternal for the both of you. And then as the film unfolds, you realize that you now have taken on a different feeling towards Andrea. Yes, I mean, I, I think my character in it is deeply confused about, about everything. And the fact that he is so much younger, you're struggling with that. Yes. What's proper and yet what's in your heart. And I think she doesn't, probably doesn't even recognize what it is herself, you know, that she feels. She just knows that something's changed. For you. Music and flowers. The one scene for me that really gives the viewer an inside glimpse of what's about to happen was when you touch his head as he puts it on mm. your lap sitting mm -hmm. out. And that's when I thought, hmm, is that a maternal sign of affection or is this definitely crossing the line for her? You're amazed by it, aren't you? You don't know what's come over you. Kind of untouched person, I guess. <laughs> That's a good way of putting it. A an big reach person. for you, Jude. Big reach. <laughs> oh, oh, Dame Maggie. I think we're revealing a little too much. TMI. <laughs> now, Dench and Smith have been friends for more than 40 years, having first met on a London stage. The two have since gone on to stellar theater and film careers. Smith is a two-time Oscar winner for her roles in The Prime of Miss Jean Brody and Neil Simon's California Suite. And Dench took home the coveted statue for her performance in Shakespeare in Love. At this point, you probably do get the pick of wonderful scripts, I would imagine. Is that really the case, or are you always struggling to find great work at this point? I just think you're lucky if you're offered work. Oh, come I on. Even when there really aren't that many lucky. parts. You know, around. Even at your point, no, as talented age, as you are, age. Our age it is. You That's the drawback. That. But you would think there would still be wonderful roles. Well, there are, and you're very lucky if they come your way. Because there are lots and lots and lots of other people you yeah. know to play them. So if you're asked to play Quite a part, a few dames it requires, I suppose, there. yes, there are too many dames around that. Um, <laughs> but not the play. real dames. <laughs> they are. No real yes, dames. The real dames. Well, what's so great is you ladies have been friends for years, so I would imagine this collaboration just seems so natural. Oh, we were easy peas. Easy peas? Easy peasy. Easy peasy. <laughs> easy peasy. <laughs> oh, easy peasy. And now on the big screensy. Oh, I know that one was bad, huh? Yeah, you took that one too far. <laughs> Jill, thanks very much.